Okay, this is a second video to measure the bandwidth of this Wrangell oscilloscope. Um, just as a sanity check, I wanted to try uh, doing the same kind of test that I did before with the Tiny SA Ultra Spectrum Analyzer. This time I'm going to use the Nano VNA as the source of the signal. And um, it also has a built-in signal generator, obviously. And you can get to that um, and set up uh, frequencies um, right from this control menu here. I've already got it uh, outputting uh, 150 megahertz, as you can see on the screen there. Um, the scope is showing 150 megahertz, jumping around a little bit. It actually outputs a um, square wave. And so um, I bumped that up to a frequency where um, it starts to kind of devolve into a sine wave um, at, because that suits the purpose of this test. And um, I've already set up cursors here, the white lines at uh, roughly a 30% decline, uh, which would represent 3 dB down. Um, so we're going to go from 150 to 250 like we did before. Let's see what we get here. And you can see we're still not 3 dB down, so now we're going to go to 300 megahertz. And now we are, it looks like, 3 dB down. So that kind of confirms what I found with the tiny um, SA Ultra, which was uh, 305 megahertz. This is showing 300 megahertz as the bandwidth um, using the Nano VNA. So it's a good confirmation that the bandwidth is higher than uh, its actual spec value. So uh, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.